Would you rather pay $650 or $66 for a smartphone? Simple. With the Appalachian Advantage plan, pay less up front and then just a few dollars more every month. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Johnson County's bee man, Jason Conley, is definitely busy these days moving unwanted honeybee swarms to new homes. Recently, he was contacted by a Knott County homeowner who had a colony of honeybees inside the walls of his home. Uh, I knew that it was a serious situation. I had contacted our extension office and they put me in contact with other people that might come and uh, remove them uh, to no luck. I've had them two or three years. But that luck recently changed and heard about Jason and gave him a call and he was, yes, be right there. Luckily, Randy Thompson knew enough about honeybees to know not to call an exterminator. And my grandfather and my father, uh, they farmed bees all their lives. And so they were special to me and I knew in my heart, I didn't want to kill them. But uh, in protection, out, out of protection for my family, I knew that I had to do something. So Monday morning, Jason got his first look at the colony of honeybees that had to be moved. It ain't, it ain't something that's going to take me 20 minutes. I'm going to be here probably six or eight hours today. You told me you was going to be here a while, so. so. We are getting ready to go into this man's home, the side of his home. We're going to uh, remove a colony. It's been here for several years. And by what I've seen so far, it's going to be a massive one. Once he got into the wall, he found a huge colony and began rescuing the honeybees and moving the hive piece by piece. This is what's called cat brood. That's new bees that's gonna be hatching off in about 21 days. This is, this is what's called uh, larva. They're actually turning into a bee at this moment. When I reestablished this colony, I'll actually take pieces of that brood and stuff that's undamaged and I'll put it in frames and we'll put that in their hive and it, it just gives them a sense of, of uh, where they're at and they're back home, they're in, a, they're in a safer place. There's nothing goes to waste in any of these removals. Uh, there's a use for every bit of it. At the end of the day, nearly seven and a half pounds of bees were relocated and ultimately saved. Now, there's a brand new hive with their names already on it. In Hindman, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.